I'm here to see the used Honda Prius weekend special that you have advertised in the paper. I was just wondering if I pre -owned. could... Pre-owned. Excuse me? Please, ma'am. We say it's pre-owned, not used. Don't be disrespectful. Okay. Um, I was wondering if I could take a look at it. Of course you can. Have a seat. I'm sorry, but I don't have all day. If you could please just show me the car, then I'll... What are I'll... you saying? Are you saying that you don't believe that I have the Honda Prius? What? No! I just wanted to possibly take it for a test drive before I... What's all this? That's historical evidence that proves the car exists. Tax forms, warranty info, the owner's manual. Yeah, there certainly is a lot of info about the car here. That'll be $15,000, please. What? I didn't agree to that. I haven't even seen the car yet. Ah, uh, here we go again. Have a little faith, will you, lady? It's my car. Did you know that? I have a close, personal relationship with that car. I know all about it. I mean, I live like seven miles from here. If I didn't own the Honda Prius in that ad, then how the hell did I get here, huh? Explain that. Well, you could have walked, rode a bike, or even driven a different car, or taken the bus, or... Ridiculous! You actually believe that? <laughs> Obviously, the only way I could have gotten here is by Honda Prius. Unbelievable! I don't care. Just show me the damn car already. I'm not going to give you any money unless I can actually see this car for myself. Whoa, 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 lady. I'm gonna have to ask that you calm down. You're causing a scene. Jim, what the hell is going on here? Ah, uh, it's just that this lady wants to see the pre-owned weekend special. And ah, I just... the silver 1976 Corvette Stingray? Good choice, lady. Classic car. You're gonna love it. What the hell are you talking about? It's a blue 2007 Honda Prius. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I used to own that Stingray. I know how it handles. I know how it sounds. I've got a close personal relationship with that car. What the hell is all this bickering going on over here? Jim here thinks that the pre-owned weekend special is a Honda Prius. It is. Bam! It's a red Honda Prius. Wait, what? No, it's not. It's blue. Jim, come on. Not even close. It's obviously red. Blue! Prove it. Just look at the ad. It says cool color. Obviously, blue is considered a cool color, whereas red is considered a warm color. No, no, no. You misinterpreted the ad. Obviously, the word cool wasn't meant that way. The writer of the ad meant for the word cool to mean like trendy, hip, you know, like red is a cool color. Excuse me? Um... We could settle this right now if we all just went out and actually looked at the car. What's her problem? Oh, she doesn't believe the car exists. <laughs> <laughs> Silly woman. You can't prove that the car doesn't exist. Yeah, where is your proven evidence that your disbelief in the car is accurate and correct? Well, for one, none of you can even show me this car. If you really had a car to sell, I would have seen it by now. Whoa, 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 look at all this. I've given you historical evidence. Look at all these papers. And I've given you testimony from people who have had experience with this car. Yeah, they've had experience with the car, but they can't even agree on what color it is, or even what type of car it is. And now that I take a closer look at this paperwork, a lot of it appears to be from several different cars as well. So you're going to base this whole purchasing decision on a few insignificant disagreements? Buying a car is a big decision. Are you going to show me the car or not? Sincerely believe that I have the car, pay me the $15,000, and maybe one day the car will reveal itself to you. Okay, I've heard enough. Thanks for wasting my time. I ask you to show me a car, but instead you show me arguments. Good day. Lady, here's the hard truth. If you don't believe that I have the car, then you're going to be tortured mercilessly and you'll be sorry that you didn't give me that 15 grand. The choice is yours. What? You're robbing me? It's not a robbery. Like I said, you have a choice in the matter. You call that a choice? This isn't a choice. It's a, a hijacking. Call it whatever you want, but if you don't believe in the car, then there's no one to blame but you. Oh, and by the way, did I mention that the car can fly? 
You know, like that car in Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets? And, and like that car at the end of Back to the Future? And, and it never needs to be refueled. Ever. And the heater? It doesn't only warm the cabin, but it makes you feel all warm and fuzzy on the inside, too. And this car will make all your hopes and dreams come true. As long as you are in the car, you're invincible. And even when you're not in the car, it follows you around and kind of watches over you. That actually can be a little annoying, but it's surprisingly easy just to imagine that it isn't there at all. Be sure to take your kids for a ride. They'll love it. Just to make sure that they stay loyal to Honda, you should probably give them rides regularly, and don't let them know about any other cars. Uh, just sign here on the dotted line, and, and don't be alarmed if you start 